Welcome to NetSuite. In this video, we will cover the basics of item records. To find a full list of item records, click on Items in the Shortcuts portlet. This list shows information in rows and columns. At the top of each column is a description of what is in that column. This includes the name of the item, the description, base price, preferred vendor, purchase price, class, and manufacturer. To view an item record, click the name of the item on the left-hand side of the page. The main information about the item is displayed here. The information includes the item name, UPC code, display name, and other information related to the setup of the item. Below this is the subtab section. Not all NetSuite systems will have the same subtabs, so we will cover generally used subtabs. To navigate between subtabs, click on the title of the subtab. The Inventory tab is broken up into multiple sections that cover information such as item cost and shipping details. Scrolling to the bottom of the Inventory subtab shows all the inventory stock locations of this item. This list shows the location of each item and the quantity on hand, as well as the value of each unit and overall units. Some subtabs also have their own subtabs. Those can be seen here. To navigate to the Inventory Vendors area, click on the subtab. This shows which vendors the product is purchased from. Another useful subtab is the Pricing subtab. This shows the price of this item and includes any quantity based pricing or discount price levels. Related Transactions shows a list of all records that include this item. This could be either a sales order, item fulfillment, invoice, or quote. Other information about the transaction will be shown in the columns of the list. The other subtabs will not be covered in this video. Thanks for watching.